I just can't surrender. Why can't I surrender? I don't know why I can't surrender. I just like, I know I should surrender, but you know, it's like, I, uh, why can't I surrender? Well, I'm going to tell you why it's so hard. The answer is very simple because surrender means I give up being God and I came to this world to be God. And it's like, that's why I'm here. And so now surrender, I mean, like I, I can't be independent anymore. I can't compete with Krishna. I mean, I can't be the enjoyer. I don't know. I don't know if I really want that. You know, it's like, it's so hard to just, I mean, like, I know I should surrender and I know when I go out there and try to enjoy and I know it won't make me happy, it never has and never will. And I know that it's in my head, but somehow I find it so hard just to surrender. Yeah, because millions of lifetimes, we're trying to be Krishna. And now we're being asked to give up that independence, do what he wants instead of what we want. So I'm not really used to that. That's like... It's a different world. So then we we find it, this thing with inside of us, I don't know what it is, but I just I can't surrender completely. Like a little bit I can, but you know, there's this fear. And like, what am I afraid of? I'm afraid that I won't be God and I don't know how I'll handle it. Uh, well, good news is you're not God and you've been handling it quite okay. But I'm thinking I'm God and I think I'm not gonna be able to handle this, you know? And so as Prabhupada always said, you're not giving up anything because nothing's yours. So, like, I'm afraid I have to surrender. I won't be God. Yeah, well, you know, you never were. So it's not really a big problem. They're not really giving up your independence because actually you never had independence. Hey, a little bit. So we kind of have to reframe this surrender thing because I know a lot of devotees are not afraid to surrender. And fear just means that I'm going to become uncomfortable if I do something. That's why I'm afraid to do it. It just doesn't feel good. And I don't know if I can handle this. I don't know if I can handle surrender. The reality is we can't handle not surrender. That's why we became devotees. And that's why we're in the world. And that's why we're suffering. And that's why everything is the way it is because we actually can't handle surrender not surrendering, excuse me, but we think I can't handle surrender because if I surrender, I'll give up my independence. I can't, I'll have to stop playing God and this and that. It's going to be horrible. I don't know how I'm going to handle it. Well, we're not handling it very well. So we have to, we have to get rid of all this fear and all these strange ideas about surrender and how it's going to be hard and I won't like it and I won't be happy because it's absolutely wrong, 100%. It's the other way. If I don't surrender, I won't be able to handle it. I don't know how I'll be happy, et cetera, et cetera. That's the way we want to see it. So this idea that I can't be God anymore, you know what? It's a good idea. And this idea of surrender, you know what? We are, we're going to surrender to something, someone, somehow, our mind, our senses, other people, social pressures, social norms, we, we can't avoid surrender. So why not surrender to the most benign, benevolent, beautiful, compassionate person? And that'd be a better idea. And really, when you look at surrender, it's, it's like, well, it's either I do what you say or I do what I say, what I think. So who's got a better mind? You or Krishna. Who has better ideas? You or Krishna. It's obvious that not surrendering is foolish. It doesn't make any sense. But this is the real battle. Well, I, I want to listen to my mind. Why? Because my mind lets me think the way I want to think. And then Krishna may ask me to do something that I don't want to do that's uncomfortable. But ultimately what Krishna asks us to do is what's really beneficial. It's really going to make us happy. So we really need to clear all the illusions about surrendering because they are illusions. And that is the goal to become a particle of dust, surrendered at the feet of our spiritual master, Srila Prabhupada, of the Goswamis, the previous acharyas, Mahaprabhu Nitananda, and Sri Radha Krishna. <laughs>